Hi, I'm Rob Zip, and you're watching The Rob Zip Show. Today is Saturday, October 26th, 2024, and I am at the Houston Museum of Natural Science for Spirits and Skeletons. It's their annual Halloween party. It'll be fun, so join me, and let's have the most epic adventures. So they do have cash bars all throughout the museum and taxidermied animals in this section. I always love, uh, it's kind of eerie walking through here, but it's really good though. It's one of the better taxidermied areas. You see there's another cash bar. There's plenty, there's plenty of booze to go around if, uh, if you like drinking. Today is definitely one of those amateur nights, as we say. Most people are wearing costumes. I'm not. I love that thing. Look at all the fun people down there. Joker and Riddler hanging out. You gotta watch those two. But yeah, this is, this is a time that a lot of people the only time a lot of people even come to the museum. You love it. The birds in the ceiling. Here's a, another cash bar. Let's give you an idea what they have. They do have some wines, some cocktails, some white claws, sodas. They do have a special cocktail for tonight. And this is a VIP area. If you paid a little extra, you can hang out here. This has a cool overview of the Hall of Paleontology. I wanted to show you. All right, we gotta say hi to the mollusk. Let's make our way downstairs. side. That's a big brain. That is a uh, reproduction of the supercomputer. It's kind of what it looks like. Let's go inside the brain. What is consciousness? What is consciousness? Maybe the colonel can tell me. What is consciousness, colonel? <laughs> it's, 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 bu it's, it's a bucket of chicken, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. <laughs> there you go. Now you know what consciousness is. It's a bucket of chicken that's finger looking good. Best paleontology hall around. This is where the main, uh, the main dance floor is. Where the, the skeletons and the spirit and skeletons. There's supposed to be a live band somewhere. I hear a, it's a DJ over here. There was a DJ over there. I don't know where the live band is. We got to see them. But there's, there's Gan, Gandalf. Gandalf is running away from me again. He's, he's always, he's always running from me. Bye. Bye. some mimes in the house. I gotta find the band. There's supposed to be a live band. Are you the live band? Are you the live band? No? <laughs> okay. Alright, this is where 
I teach y'all about petroleum oil drill, like there's an oil drill, but there's an actual live band on the stage. It's an actual rock concert at the museum. It's so hard to get up here. How did all these people get up here? showed up right when the band ended. What can you do? You do have some water. Uh, you know, that's good. That's good. They're gonna drill in my brain! Get a little closer look at this. It's an offshore derrick there. Tanker. Tanker boat. Freeways with lots of traffic. All the traffic's moving. It's not always like that. But that's uh, kind of what downtown looks like. The Hall of Ancient Egypt is open. King's Tut, King Tut's tomb is open if you have the extra ticket. But you gotta always come see the Hall of Ancient Egypt when you're here. The Grand Egyptian Museum in Cairo just opened recently. I would love to go there and see that. Someone could sponsor me. Some of the stuff should maybe belong there, perhaps. But I'm glad I could see it now. See it here. You know, the Grand Egyptian Museum can only hold so much. Look at this. I love museums that you can see like a centerpiece at the end of the at the end of the hall. I'm gonna be cremated. That's a uh, that's a mummy being buried in a pyramid. That is a, an actual mummy. Right there. Do you think? Yeah, creepy. It's always cool to go back in time to ancient Egypt and see how they lived. It was such an interesting civilization. Um, again, I would love to go to the Grand Egyptian Museum. Just need a little help to get there. Coffin of the Lady Baquette. This is an actual, actual coffin. Here's a head. It just says mummified head. Doesn't say who. Poor guy. There's some more mummies. The caskets are open. You can see, you can see their toes. And we're not big people. They're not like, uh, like me. Imagine. Oh, look at this guy. He's had a full head of hair. Yikes. Yep, real people that died thousands of years ago. Are they gonna put me on display in a couple thousand years? I highly doubt it. I hope not. But this is really cool. <laughs> love it. There's so much in this museum. This is why I love this place. Look at this golden, golden throne room. <laughs> All right, this is so cool. It's cool just to see this up here. Um, so again, this is the King Tut, the King Tut's tomb exhibit. She's saying, give me a hug. Museum store is open. The great 
Hypostyle Har at Karnak. Man. And then Death by Natural Causes is a favorite of the museum. It's gone and come back more than once. Again, this is an extra purchase, but if you haven't seen it, I do recommend it. The Wortham Giant Screen Theater is playing Scream on a continuous loop. Look at this. Such a classic. The main hallway, of course, is another cash bar. Plenty of cash bars. None of the lines are super long. The planetarium is showing stuff on repeat tonight as well. Full dome visuals. Hey, look! It's bananas in pajamas, bananas in pajamas, bananas in pajamas. So if you wanted to purchase tickets for this event, members were $50, the public was $60. The VIP area I showed you is $120. And the add-ons, the Death by Natural Causes and King Tut's Tomb were $18 each. Mix the uh, Spirits and Skeletons is what this one's called, but they typically do the Mixers and Elixirs. They're gonna do one on New Year's Eve. You can get $5 off your ticket now if you buy it today. So you can purchase your tickets. You can scan that code, go to the HMNS website to get those. Going outside the building here, and they have more. They have food trucks, they have uh, food stands, they've got cookies, they've got dancing skeletons on the side of the building, and a lot of people just getting out, get some fresh, some fresh Houston air out here. All right, guys, thanks for coming with me to Spirits and Skeletons here at the Houston Museum of Natural Science. Hope you had as much fun watching this as I had walking around and seeing everything. Um, you do want to come to the New Year's Eve party, go to the website, hmns.org, and uh, it's going to be just as much fun, just maybe less costumes. Um, and again, what should I do for New Year's Eve? It's not even something I thought about yet, but anyway, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. I'm Rob Zip. I'll see you next time. Bye. Before I leave, I found the most metal dude here. It's King David! Yeah. Awesome, bro. <laughs>